Hey everyone, welcome back to Sebrov. Now while playing the Valorant game on your Windows 10 and 11, you might stuck on the loading screen and sometime even on the map screen. So there are a few simple fixes that you will have to apply. Just make sure that you do not skip any part because I have covered the entire solution and I'm very sure one of the solution will surely work for you. And the very first thing that I would recommend you for the instant fix, you can close your Valorant game. Now make a right click on the windows icon, click on task manager. Now here you have to look for anything related to Valorant or the right games. If you get anything related to them, make a right click on it and choose end task. Okay, so many times it happened that any file related to right or, or Valorant is running in the background due to which your game is not loading up. Okay, so you will have to completely close it then you will have to retry again and now you can close it next click on your windows search type cmd right click on the command prompt then click on run as admin click on yes the black window will be up now here you have to run two different command that you can manually type or you can also copy and paste from the description so the first one will be sc delete space vgc hit the enter key and the next command will be sc space delete space vgk again hit the enter key now you can close it next click on your windows search type appwiz dot cpl hit the enter key again now here you need to scroll down a bit and you have to look for right vanguard once you get it make a right click on it and choose uninstall click on yes click on yes again and now you can close it next bring up your file explorer go to local disk c look for write games double click on it then you have to go to the valorant folder double click on it then double click on the live folder and here you will find two different files by the name manifest debug file manifest non ufs files so you will have to make a right click on it and choose delete delete both of them so the problem can be because of misconfigured manifest file so we will have to delete it so once you are done you can close it so now after applying all these solution you will have to simply restart the computer once the computer gets restarted you will have to come to the valorant website then you have to click on play free just sign in then it will ask you to download so you have to click on the download option the downloading will be started now click on the downloaded file click on yes and then click on install again and wait until the game has been properly installed all right so this is the best fix now in case still if you have the problem then what you will have to do next click on your windows search type allow and from the suggestion you have to click on allow an app through windows 5 all now here you have to click on change settings click on allow another app click on browse now here you have to go to this pc local disk c then you have to look for write games double click on it then double click on valorant then on live and here you will find valorant.exe select it then click on open click on add once added make sure that these private and public options are being checked again click on allow another app click on browse this will take you to the same location so from the top click on the right games then double click on right client and select right client services.exe click on open click on add it's already added on my end but you will have to add it and then make sure that both these options are being checked Again, click on allow another app, click on browse from the left hand menu option, click on this PC, go to local disk C, then you have to look for program files, double click on it, then you have to look for write Vanguard, double click on it, and here you will find vgc.exe, select it, then click on open, click on add, once added, make sure both these options are being checked, now finally click on OK. Then make a right click on the Valorant game icon. 
click on properties now here in the run section from the drop down select to minimized then from the top menu option click on compatibility and make sure this run this program as an administrator option has been checked again click on apply click on ok now try to play your game and see that if the problem has been fixed now in case if it's still the problem occur then what you will have to finally do you will need to click on your window search type appwiz.cpl hit the enter key now here from the left hand menu option click on turn windows feature on or off and here you have to disable a few of the features like hyper v so you will have to uncheck it then scroll down uncheck this virtual machine platform windows hypervision platform and then also you have to disable microsoft defender application guard so you can uncheck all these four options then you have to click on ok then finally it will be restarting the computer and then check back again i'm very sure that your valorant loading problem while starting the game or in middle of the game problem will be surely fixed so that's all guys for today hopefully this all effective solution will surely work for you and if yes do not forget to like and subscribe and i see you in the next video Bye bye